Game design is one of the most crucial parts of game development. Without it, not many games would be worth playing. Good game design just makes a game that much better. So if we want to make better games, we need to become better game designers. In my efforts to become a better game designer, I came across the book The Art of Game Design by Jesse Schell, and I want to use my takeaways from that book to help you. If you're interested, I'll leave a link to the book in the description. It's an affiliate link, so by using it, you'll be helping out my channel at no cost to you. Before we talk about becoming better game designers, we have a few questions we need answered. First, what is game design? Then what do game designers do? And how can we become better game designers? These three questions are answered pretty early in the book, and to me they seem to form the foundation of everything else that's covered. Let's make sure we're on the same page by giving a brief and simple definition to game design. Jesse Schell says game design is the act of deciding what a game should be. That includes how a game feels, how it looks, and how it sounds. Shortly after that, he tells us that a game designer is anybody that makes decisions about how a game should be. That means that you're likely already a game designer. Now our last question was, how can you become a better game designer? We already established that if you make decisions about how a game should be, then you're a game designer. The first step to becoming a better game designer is to admit to yourself that you're a game designer. Start by calling yourself a game designer, otherwise you'll be subconsciously holding yourself back. You are the first and biggest obstacle you'll encounter with anything you try to do. So if you can get past it early, everything else will be easy. Now, in short, becoming a better game designer means becoming a better decision maker. A lot of that will come with practice, but in the form of a video series, I want to cover some of the ideas and concepts from the art of game design that will put you on the right track to start making better and more informed choices for your games. Keep your eye out for the next video on this topic, where I'll talk a little bit more about some of the useful skills you need to practice for game design. We'll also go in more depth about what a game designer does. So again, the link to the book's in the description. Be sure to check it out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.